notification of massive intellectual property violation. I'm notifying USPTO about a very serious violation of science, okay? Uh, everybody knows what is a week, what is a weekend. So when you turn, you turn on uh, lights on a candle, you have a week here that's working. We have temperature and we have the hydrology, okay? So everybody knows what is a week. Uh, we have weak weaking, we have hydrology and thermodynamics composition. USPTO issued patents, 21,945 patents on weak and weaking. If you combine with capillary or capillarity, it goes to 94,000 patents. So, if you, if you find thermal and heat conductivity, how heat is, is, is conducted, 61,513 patents. But this, if you go to unsaturated hydraulic conductivity, you have 17 patents only because hydrology has been neglected. So everybody knows what is weak, but a weak is a terminology, is a hydrology of oil lamps or candles. It's not supposed to be used in patents unless for oil and candle. Because I have three patents. I have three patents uh, about a deep hydrology uh, using common knowledge from uh, hydrogeology and soil physics. If you go to hydrology literature and you're trying to find the functioning of wicks, you won't find. If wick is not mentioned in hydrology, you see, you don't have this. Wick is not there. Wick is not in hydrology because of thermodynamics. And uh, physical and chemical hydrogeology also, you don't have anything about wicks there. You don't have anything about wicks. And uh, the deep knowledge in, of the fluids moving porosity we have in uh, soil size hydrology like this one we have uh, 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 saturated zone and saturated zone when it goes upward imaginary capillary tube this is terminology is old as much as a hundred years you can see soil physics also in soil physics People don't work with wicks. Wicks not mentioned in soil physics. So you go there, water. See, no soil physics. No soil physics. Go to the other side. You don't see anything about wicks. Anything about wicks. What happens is that uh, fluid movement porosity is since 1856 when Henry Darcy he proposed a law about measuring it. In the saturated side, when you go to unsaturated side, we have 1907. So we have common knowledge more than 100 years old. It's not being used in the patent system. My demand to USPTO is to respect common knowledge and stop issuing patents with uh, uh, lay people terminology. People don't understand too much hydrology and respect common knowledge and around 20 30,000 patents have to be cancelled and in the future everybody can develop advanced hydrology using common knowledge now read in the textbooks. Bye bye.